Well, happy birthday, my July 17th birthday friends. I hope you're having a fabulous day. This year for your birthday, I'm going to give you a fortune telling reading. How the general, what's something that you can look forward to this year in your birthday. Then I'm going to ask the magical, uh, magical message from the fairies to chime in. And finally, hang on to the end because I'm going to get you to think of your birthday wish and put your birthday wish into the energy of the cards. And we'll see what the angels say about bringing you your birthday wish. So without further ado, let's get started. Happy birthday, July 17th, friends. Happy birthday, July 17th, birthday friends. What fortune do we have for our July 17th birthday friends? What fortune do we have for our July 17th birthday friends? Cards are ready. Okay. Oh, the blender. Mix it up. It's going to be a, a very busy year. Broken mirror. The snake. Illness. And the cats happiness underlying energy happiness okay okay stay with me don't leave so you might be thinking oh this is going to be a bad year no i don't think it is i think if you have had some health issues the tree is a symbol of um health and of course the snake is in the medical symbol um i think and then this is you joining forces if you feel like um, you've had some bad luck with your health or something's been going on with your health for a very long time. This is the year you're going to finally get some answers. This is the year you're finally going to, somebody's going to hand you a gift and say, this is what you need. You might need to change your diet. Um, you might need to, uh, just bring some more happiness into your life, but somehow there's going to be something that's going to come into your life. That's really going to change it up. July 17th birthday friends. Um, you might have felt that, um, you know what, you might've even been in an accident here. Um, and maybe that's created some injuries that you're, you're still struggling with, um, uh, I see that that ending for you again. I, there was another birthday reading I had and they had a very, very similar reading. Um, I think you're going to have to go through three phases. Uh, you might have to go through three specialists and one will will show the way forward. One will kind of take you backwards and the other one you you're like, yeah, I'm not sure about that. If you have a good look at that. But this there is one that has some kind of, I don't know, I don't want to say secret. Um, they want to maybe try something that has never been tried before and it's going to work and um, you're going to be very, very happy with that. This is going to be a very busy year for you, a very busy year. Um, it's going to feel like this. I want to, like, a, like a, a, a bad stock market chart, up and down, up and down, up and down. Um, but the ups will end in the long run. And I think it, overall, it's going to be a very, very happy year for you. Um, I see some minor little things like colds or stubbing your toe, um, banging your finger in a drawer, that kind of thing. Um, I, I'm, I'm saying it's minor because you've got the happiness and the healing card here as well. Because um, a tree brings us health, right? Um I think though, yeah, you're, it's going to be like a crazy, crazy year. I, I don't want, I hate to say that, but you know what? You might be endorsing that. Maybe if you have spent a lot of time in bed, you're like, yeah, I'm ready for the energy. I'm ready to, to let's go. Um, but yeah, I, I think this will be a year. And if you're totally healthy right now, I'm going to tell you right now, then look after your health. Uh, because there is the potential here, you know, and, and that could just even be a hangover, right? Drink too much, you get a hangover. Eat too much, you gain weight, and maybe it affects your blood pressure. Um, you know, you don't exercise and, you know, you get you, your energy levels drop. It's nothing catastrophic here because you do have the the healing in, in the middle. And you do have the blender. Um, blender sometimes to me is also health. Uh, because, you know, you put food into a blender and, and you mix it all up. But I think this is going to be a whirlwind year for you. And I think that might bring you some stress. 
if anything, uh, just because you're going to be just so busy. But you're going to be happy to be busy for some reason. Um, like I said, maybe the last couple of years, things have been kind of down and out and, uh, and you know, and you feel like it's been a lot of bad luck. So you want to mix things up. Um, I think you're going to be very, very happy, but I think it has to do with food. If you look at the cat card, cat card also has a food dish open. Um, any kind of minor little issues here, I think have to do with food and drink. Um, so, so just be mindful of that. If you find you're waking up with too many hangovers, you might want to pull that in a little bit. Um, or if you're gaining a little bit of weight, um, pay attention to it quickly before it becomes anything, anything too, too major. Um, again, um, I think you're going to end up, you, you're going to have maybe like three, um, what are they called? What are they called when you go see the doctor? I don't go see the doctor, so I don't know. Um, what are they, and they give you a diagnosis. I think you're going to have three and one is the right one and, uh, the other two, but you'll know that you'll know which one you'll pick the right one. Cause it'll feel like a gift. It's like, Oh, that's the answer. That's the answer. Also, you might be surprised with a, a very a unique and fun gift today on your birthday. We've got some uh, lucky numbers here. 15, 13, 17, 8, 11, and 7. Um, I don't do that for every birthday, only when it moves me to say that. So usually when I do say that, that is lucky for you. Um I'm just looking. And of course, seven is, um, this is your birthday, seven and 17. So this is double deep, deep, deep. You saw me shuffle them. I didn't do that. I didn't pick that. So this is absolutely a strong message for you. Look after your health this year. Look after your health. Um, and anything, any minor thing that does come up, you'll be, you'll be just fine. Um, all right, so let's see what the magical message from the fairies have to say about this as well. Magical message from the fairies. Fairies, what message do you have for our July 17th birthdays? What message do you have for our July 17th birthdays? What message do you have for our July 17th birthdays? Cards are ready. Oh, interesting cut. Do some research. You need more information about this situation. Look into it further before proceeding. What did I tell you? There's three things. The, the cat card. One is forward. One is backward. One is what the F was that. So do some research. So when these little minor things come up, um, I want you to be very, very careful uh, uh, with that so that you're you're constantly moving forward so that that's actually a very strong strong message for you this year if it's, if it seems to be too good to be true it probably is if it seems too easy it probably is okay so now I want you to put your birthday wish put your birthday wish into the cards July 17th birthdays July 17th birthday wish July 17th, birthday wish. Angels, what say you? Cards are ready. Oh, not the right time. Reconsider. But don't stop. Okay, uh, this message is very clear. So, if you have been making this wish for a while or you came up with the, this wish, the reason you aren't getting it is because it's not the right time. Timing is everything. Sometimes not getting your wish is a blessing in disguise because something better comes along. And that's exactly what the angels here are saying. Reconsider. Maybe your wish is out of, um, well, nothing is impossible, but maybe it is, for example, if you aren't working and you wish for a million dollars, I mean, the, it probably won't happen. But if you wish for $10, if you ask the angels for $10 for this week, that might happen. Because they're saying, don't stop. Don't stop your wish. Just reevaluate it and reconsider it. If you're wishing for a specific person and they haven't texted you, they haven't called, it's not the right time. Maybe the, maybe you're being protected from that person. Maybe you need to reconsider. Um, but don't stop looking for love, right? 
Um, you know, so that's, I like this message. It's, it's not saying no, it's saying no, what you're, what you're wishing for right now is not the right time. Reconsider it, reword it, refigure it out because don't stop because that's very hopeful that it is on the way. All right. So don't forget to give this a thumbs up while you're here. Have a look around, see what other messages I have for cancer um, have a happy, happy birthday and a fantastic year. Thanks for watching and take good care.